Welcome to Block Bench Unity Diaries, uh, the first of many. Today I wanted to show you how I made this 3D model for my video game, Hawaii Match 3D. Um, today I'm making Lagan Ma. It's this spicy, chili, um, crisps, um, Chinese cooking. Um, in Hawaii, we put on anything. Uh, so here's Hawaii Match 3D. I wanted to just show you. This is me picking up uh, the Lagan Ma. I'm just pausing it to get a better look on it, but it's just launching in the air because there's so much bounce on it. I gotta fix that in the future, but make a match, star, that's it. So just sit back. Um, breathe. Tutorial's just about to get started. There we go. So what I'm doing is I got some Laogan Ma as a PNG. I take the name of it, put it into uh, my new project inside of uh, Blockbench. Um, also, I've got this feed or this video playing back at 400%. So if you guys have any feedback about if it's too fast, if it's too slow, please let me know. Um, I like that rhyming pun. Um, so here it is. Here's what I um, am mocking up right here, the log on ma on the right hand side. Um, I see the two bulges at the top and the bottom, so that's what I'm going for. What I'm doing is just duplicating these um, cubes that I've already made um, because it's easier to kind of just like tweak them a bit um, instead of creating a brand new tiny cube with a uh, command N. I'm working on a Mac as well, as you can see. Um, I'd be really interested to hear if you guys are using a PC or Mac. Please leave it in the comments. That'd be cool. I want to hear what you guys are using. So anyway, um, I'm picking up this block. I'm bringing it back down. And then I am um, pretty much, I feel like I've mocked it up right here um, at this point. It's a pretty simple um, um, form. So only six cubes. Um, pretty great. So the next thing that I'm doing right here is I'm adding these textures uh, with a PNG that in the, few, in the later in this video I'll actually forget to include, um, but I'll figure it out. Um, so just a few things that come up inside of you know creating these kind of um, things at Blockbench or these tiny little gotchas. Um, so I'll, I'm part of posting these is really to kind of share, um, you know, what's kind of like tripping me up. Um, I actually got stuck for a long time, a couple of weeks really. Um, GM Roar posted a question about this and I actually uh, did a live stream uh, to showcasing uh, how if you don't add textures to every single side, all six sides of every single cube inside of your um, block bench model, you it won't render any of the textures. Um, you'll get a white .obj uh, file inside of Unity, so that's what you want to do. Um, just make sure you always have a texture on every single side of every single cube. So getting back into this thing, it was so quick, it's such an easy model um, that I'm just talking over it, and that's fine because I'll be making a lot of these. Um, here's the cap. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get that sheen um, of the, the gradient with that nice whitish um, red in the top, but I'm noticing right now that it's too much, so I'm kind of evening it out and removing it. Um, I don't like having too much of the same thing on each side because then it just looks like faker and faker. Um, so here I'm ex exporting it um, and just putting in a new folder, pulled it into, here I am pulling it into Unity, making a folder in Unity um, for the prefab. I brought in the MTL, the dot .obj, obj um, but I didn't bring in the PNG. So here is me looking for it frantically to find for uh, this recording uh, where it is, but none of them are missing. So I'm looking back in and I drag it back in again. Um, and I'm noticing that it's still missing, so I'm just like getting, what? But then I'm noticing here, after I drag that in, that there we go, I just didn't have that PNG texture file. Um, so I'm gonna add the rigid body, the box collider, uh, reshaping the box collider to make sure it's pretty snug to the, to the form, and then I've brought it in. Uh, so there it is in the game, but I'm noticing it's just a bit too huge. Actually, log on ma is not that huge, so I made it smaller, considerably smaller, and now it looks good. Um, so that's it. Please let me know if you like this video.